far. <laughs> <laughs> we would talk all day long about women and what they should be wearing. I'm going to use that as a segue. We're here to talk to you. <laughs> Can you take me seriously like this? <laughs> yeah. Me too. Okay, so we're going to talk <laughs> about gender and stereotypes. We're at the beach, which is pretty much the centralized location to feel like shit about yourself. And that is the first curse word that I've said on the Fortnite Hood channel. Really? Oh, I've said so many. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. So, I'm sorry if you're offended. The pause button is right there. Just go away. Um... Gender and orientation. Do you know? Uh, sex is what you're born with. Gender is how you identify. Orientation is your preference in mate. Exactly. Today is gender. I don't necessarily know what it means to be like a girl. And I kind of, I don't know. Because, like, androgyny is identified very heavily with um, self reported happiness in the sense of androgyny being having the positive characteristics of both male and female. Um, so I consider myself androgynous in the sense of like, I'm emotionally very caring and very cuddly and very warm, but I'm also like getting it done, um, organized. Pragmatic. Yes, exactly, yeah. pragmatic. Are you, how do you feel about that? I am right there. Yeah, exactly, yeah. Okay. Well, and especially like, I, I talk a lot about who I used to be, like Puklora. Puklora was very much a, person in my past who was far more masculine than I am today. And today, like, I really embrace femininity, but I do still feel that as an individual, like, I don't necessarily identify with either gender. Like, I love being a girl, and I love dressing up, and right. seriously, like, nail polish. I love it. I do. <laughs> Just talk. <laughs> That's fine. We didn't make a point. That's 